Hi guys, welcome to my channel Spicy. Today I'm gonna show you how to make yugu chobab, which is sweet and vinegar the rice stuffed in fried bean curd pockets. This is the package for the yugu chobab. I'm gonna use can of tuna. About 3 bowls of steamed rice and 2 serrano peppers. This yubu package comes with fried tofu pouches, dried veggie seasoning which contains sesame seed, dried carrots, bok choy and black sesame seed and vinegar sauce for the rice. Remove two food pouches from the package, squeeze lightly to drain excess sauce to use in the rice mixture. Add everything from the yubu packages into the rice, which was two packets of dried veggies seasoning and two packets of vinegar sauce. These are the basic ingredients for yubu chuba. And I'm gonna add a can of tuna and two serrano peppers for personal preference. Please make sure to drain all the water out from the tuna and sprinkle a little bit of black pepper. Let's chop up some serrano peppers into small pieces to give a pretty green color and also a little bit of spice. It's all ready, now you just have to mix it well. Mm, I love the color of the rice. And for your preference, you can also add some drizzle of sesame oil. It's time to stuff the seasoned rice mix into the two food pouches. And this is what it looks like. This seasoned rice mix also tastes good with roasted seaweed. You can just wrap it up with. I think it looks pretty like this and you can serve it with wasabi in the middle. These sweet and vinegar rice stuffed in fried bean curd pockets are delicious. It can be a great finger food at the dinner party 
and its popular cream picnic food along with kimbap. It's fun and rewarding to make, so don't be afraid to try out for yourself. You can easily get these yugu pockets from an Asian market. The ingredients are versatile, so you don't necessarily have to put tuna in it. You can use it whatever you like. If you do make it, tag me on Instagram with a picture of it. I really wish you liked this video, and if you did, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe with the bell so you don't miss any new content. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you.